beast that ascendeth out of the bottomless pit shall make war against them and shall overcome them and kill them and their dead bodies shall lie in the street of the great city sister we're all aware of the book of revelation you can twist those words to mean almost anything right here in los angeles 15 people have been brutally murdered all over the country, cult killings are spreading. There are signs of his work. Sister, this is the 20th century. So one mustn't mention Satan in polite company. His power is growing. All of these bodies have been marked with inverted pentagrams, his sign. We appreciate the intensity of your beliefs. But the last thing the church needs is to stir up more sensationalism about devil worship. Otherwise, we may all end up on Geraldo. No. I believe it's best if you return to your convent and in seclusion meditate less on the devil and more on the virtues of our Lord Jesus Christ. Especially the virtue of humility. Thank you. Listen, lady. The marks are always exactly six inches in diameter. The wound is always at the center. Keep going. One condition. No killing and no death penalty either. Okay, whatever you say. Swear it. You got it. What's your name? Near Sunset Boulevard. The south entrance to Elysian Park. When? Soon. Don't forget your promise, Logan. Psycho fucking killer smart enough to stay out of the rain. How are my lovebirds doing? Hey, Carmen, how about a nightcap later? Dream on. It's too bad, Carmen. Watching your ass is the only thing keeping me awake up here. <laughs> Franklin. All positions clear. 
See, three nights of this shit. Everybody's burned out. See, man, I told you, the bride on the phone is his girlfriend, setting us up, okay? You know how these serial freaks love mind games? Trust me, she wasn't his girlfriend. He'll show. You know, that's all you've been saying for three days is he'll show, man. You ought to just put that to music. You know what your problem is, Ali? <sighs> all this mumbo jumbo occult bullshit's got you spooked. The guy's got you thinking he's the boogeyman of the Ku Klux Klan. Fuck you. Let's fuck you, sir. <laughs> Take out our fucking parade. Is that what you call it? I call it a jerk off. Bro, she asked for 72 hours. I gave them to you. Nothing happened. Look, I told you I didn't know when it was going down. But this location fits the pentagram pattern on the map, and my informant says this is where he's gonna strike next. Look, I can't risk it anymore, Russ. Mm. It's too thin. I mean, I got 18 men sitting here, but he's liable to hit on the west side tonight. Hey, Russ! Yeah. They lost Carmen, park side north of Sunset. Pulled her into a car. Nobody came down towards sunset. Up there's the entrance to the park. Park? Yeah, it's locked. Take the road.
Detective Russell Logan has been taken off the critical list after a dramatic life and death struggle in the early morning hours. This is the third time in less than five years that Logan has been responsible for the death or capture of a serial killer. Co-workers described alleged pentagram killer Patrick Channing, an employee of the Department of Water and Power for nine years, as quiet, solitary, good at his job. Just freak used to work in this place. It gives me the creeps to think this guy had anything to do with the water supply. Well, I'll stick the bottom water from now on, thank you. Detective Logan, do you really think you'll get the death penalty on this one? You better believe it. Going, Russ? Stomach okay? <laughs> You're not gonna let these pussies wimp out of me, are you? I mean, if a twisted scumbag like me doesn't deserve the big one, who does? Right on, I'm with you, pal. I knew I could count on you, Russ. I owe you one. See you around, buddy boy. I doubt it. Come on, Whoa. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Harold, will help your hammer on. Come on, give it to me. Give it to hey, me. Come yeah. on. Yeah. Yeah. Sister Agnes, I'm sorry. Yeah. Hey, Logan, you. Yeah, Ooh. coming. Plan 
classic vintage. What is this, early Thursday? Yes, sir. Drink up, drink to you. Logan, shoot. Oh. I warned you. I'm, I'm sorry, you're gonna have to speak up. I'm sorry, you're gonna have to speak up. I warned you. No death penalty. Stop it before it's too late. Yes, it is. What? Oh. Left one's a little loose. <laughs> Adios, creep. It's just aftershocks. It's like a chicken with his head cut off. Getting a little jumpy, huh, Jack? Need you. There's an emergency. They'll have to wait. Get the evidence text here right now. What's going on? I got a fucking bloodbath in my. Sir, they told us to bring you immediately.
freaks brought her back to the same place. Good-looking bride, nice threads. Doesn't look like a nut. Says she knows who did it, and she'll only talk to you, man. Let's give the lady what she wants. Detective Logan, miss. Seton, to Seton. I didn't want to come here, but I didn't know what else to do. Well, you did the right thing. Sit down, please. Why don't you tell me what you know about the officer's death? You seem frightened, Miss Seaton. You really don't know, do you? You really don't know who killed her. Why don't you tell me? The pentagram killer. Patrick Channing, the pentagram killer. I don't have time to play games. Games? You talk about games? I saw you on TV celebrating a man's execution like it was a party. Bye-bye, Patrick. Adios. Good riddance. Except he's back. You might have executed his body, but his spirit has been released. Oh, I see. Spirit? Yes, his spirit. And I am frightened. I am very frightened. Well, thank you for coming in, Miss Seaton. Don't patronize me. I am not some crackpot. I am a professional psychic. I helped the St. Louis Police Department find a missing child. Well, this who... isn't about a missing child, is it, Miss Seaton? No. It's murder. And it's not going to stop. You are not dealing with a man anymore. He's become a force. I promise you I'll do the best I can. You've already broken one promise to me. You promised no death penalty. You lied. That was you? Well, it's certainly a pleasure to meet you, Miss Seaton. I've been looking forward to this. Actually, I wanted to thank you. How well did you know Channing? I didn't. Then how did you know where he was going next? Look, I try to stay away from police work, but when I saw the picture of the little girl he killed, I opened myself up to him, and I've never felt such blackness and rage. So you used your psychic powers to figure out where he was going next. I suppose that's also how you got my home phone number. Now I have a friend who works at the phone company. Look, I helped you, and you broke your promise to me, and now he's not just after you, he's after me too. How do I reach you? You call me, Logan. Soon.
So that's it? After all this time, she just walks in here like that? Maza, get on her ass. Don't let her out of your sight. With pleasure. Man, we are on a roll. They nailed the guy who did karma. They just brought him in. You killed my friend, asshole, didn't you? Didn't you? That guy's been like that ever since they found him in an alley across from the park. Had the murder weapon in his hand. Looks like a slam dunk. Who is he? No ID. Just some junkie with the tracks all over his legs. I don't know what this guy's veg done, but he's ready for the salad bar. See you around, buddy boy. What'd you say? I didn't say anything. You okay? Hey, Russ. That guy looked like he could kill anybody to you. Hey, maybe he did it and went in the shot, man. Yeah, and Perkins loves you like a father. And just by coincidence, our little psychic shows up today. Bullshit. It's a setup, man. And it wouldn't hurt if we had a warrant. We'll just tell the judge we had a psychic hunch. Yeah, kiss my black ass. You know, it looks like the psychic business pays pretty well. Forget it. You wouldn't look good in a turban. Shh, I don't know. No, it's too bad the chick doesn't have a view. Horoscope, man. Hey, you better look out, man, because she might have a voodoo love doll of you around here somewhere, too. following me the last two blocks. You crazy lady. Don't bother lying. It's all over your aura. My what? If you're lonely, try computer dating. But leave me alone or I'll call the cops. My name's Andrea Gregg. Nancy 
Rosenberg tells me you're the most accurate psychic she's ever seen. I'd like to set up a private reading, please. My number is 555-0511. Uh, hi, it's Paul. Uh, look, I'm, I'm not going to come over on Friday night. You're, you're just too spooky for me. As somebody who knows what I'm thinking before I do. I know I should have said this to your face, but I guess... I guess I'm too chicken shit. Bye, Tess. Looks like the score is pentagram 16. LAPD one. Nah, not even one, huh, Logan? How about a romantic rendezvous? Church across from Olvera Street. Buenos dias, buddy boy. Church across from Olvera Street. Buenos dias, buddy boy. in the seat and we're going to have a little chat. I don't believe this. You've been going through my things? Take a listen to this, Ollie. Those are private messages. You can't do that. I can do anything I damn well want. Somebody who knows what I'm thinking before I do. I know I should have said this to your face, but I guess... I guess I'm too chicken shit. Bye, Tess. It's the next one. was it? He was on there. He was on there. There were three messages on that machine. The machine says two messages. Maybe you erased it. I didn't erase shit, man. I heard him. Who? Channing! I mean somebody imitating his voice. Guess again, Logan. What if it was Channing? You're gonna listen to me, and I don't want any more horse shit. No more goblins, no more tooth fairies. You're gonna tell me about your friends. What are you talking about? Look, this yuppie psychic routine just doesn't cut it. I'm thinking you two are part of the same cult. You know, I bet it's even your cute little idea to leave that zombie in the alley, make it look like he killed Carmen, is that right? We found the killer. Are you surprised? No. It was probably some poor soul that he, he possessed and then abandoned. Oh, yeah, listen, don't fuck with me! Let go of me! There's a woman dead, a good cop, and you had something to do Let with it! Let go of me! Russ, cool out, man. Russell. Save it for the paying customers. Lady, he's not in danger. You are. Come on. Where are you taking me? Olvera Street. That's what the machine said, right? A romantic little rendezvous. Let's go. He's here. Channing. Ray, Russ, excuse me. What are we doing down here, Russ? Church across from Olvera Street. That's what the voice on the machine said. What voice? There was no voice on that machine. All right, so maybe I did erase it. Hey, look, I don't like the feeling of this, man. It's spooky. And the chick is spooky here. Now, what if she's on the level? Come on, Ollie, give me a break. Hey, look, I'm serious, man. You see how she was looking at me? Uh, she, she said I was in danger. We just need to calm down. Let's check out the area. Come on.
was hell. Ollie? Ollie? Get an ambulance. doing exactly what he wants you to do. Logan! Peggy. Where'd he go? Who? Oh. The guy who just jumped off the roof. Jumped off the roof? Man, what you been smoking? We should use some. <laughs> All right, Russ. Let's try it again. What for? Because I want to know how a guy jumps off a ten-story building, waves at you, and then just walks away. Where's my witness? Oh, you mean the woman whose house you illegally entered? Who you then abducted? and recklessly endangered the life of during a high-speed auto pursuit. Her lawyer came and got her. You want to hear the size of the lawsuit he was talking about? Well, it's too bad about your suspect, Logan. Maybe he flew away, you know? Like a little birdie. Tweet, tweet. <laughs> For us. Yeah. I know. Sir? Yeah. They got Mazza. they get him up there.
Get him out of here. Lieutenant Grimes, I want you to take over the investigation immediately. Yes, sir. God, I hope I am going nuts, Al. Because if I'm not, Grimes isn't going to do much good. Father, for I have sinned. How long since your last confession, my son? It's been a long time. We had kind of a parting of the ways. Holy Mother, the Church accepts all who return penitent to its fold. I don't know if I'm penitent, Father. I don't know much of anything anymore. I thought I knew where things stood, but... Please go on. My dad was shot, and after that, I guess I just said, forget it. I mean, if there was a God, how could he take my dad, who never did anything wrong in his whole life? My mother went crazy. She never stopped praying. She never stopped saying that my dad's death was God's will. Look, Father, I've seen a lot of dead bodies, and when someone's dead, they're dead, right? I mean, maybe I am going nuts, but I, I need some answers here. What is your question, my son? Can the spirits of the dead return and actually take over the bodies of people who are still living? You mean possession? Yes. How can they be stopped? Before I answer your question, it is necessary that I ask you one of my own, my son. What is it, Father? How's the stomach, buddy boy?
Where's the priest who just came in here? Priest? I didn't see any priest. No, Logan. number and ask for Inspector Perkins. On second thought, talk to Lieutenant Grimes. He'll take care of your damages personally. Okay, yeah, anytime, officer. Look, Miss Seaton. Tess. Tess, right. I want to... You don't have to thank me. Would you quit finishing my sentences for me, please? Sorry forget sometimes. God, I could use a drink. All right. Tell me again from the beginning. What the hell is going on here? I don't really know myself, Logan. All I know is that he's a spirit now. And except for mind games, like making you see things or hear things, a spirit can't really do anything in the physical world without a body. So Channing possesses bodies. She just got out of the hospital. Might want to put her back in there. Okay, so he possesses bodies, but I saw him. I saw him. He wants you to see him. That's his game. He can reveal himself to you, or he can hide. And what am I supposed to do? Look, I spend most of my time telling people about their love life, or, or if their TV show's gonna be renewed. I have heard of a woman, though. Maybe she could help us.
Hi, we'd like to see Sister Marguerite, please. Sister Marguerite doesn't see visitors. Could you tell her that it's a matter of police business, Sister? I'm afraid that'll mean very little to her. Tell her it's a very important spiritual matter. All right, wait here. Surprised you didn't pull your gun on her, Logan. Marguerite, we need your help. An entity has returned and is killing. How did the entity die? Execution. Sister, what can you tell us about the first power? Church doesn't allow us to discuss that. Look, sister, I don't mean to be disrespectful, but I really don't care what the church feels. People are getting killed. Forget the first power. It's not to be played with. Sister Marguerite. Come on, you heard the lady, Tess. She just can't cut it. So what's your next hot lead? You know, you're not doing so great yourself, Logan. The only thing I've heard out of you so far is that you need a drink. But it did me more good than seeing the flying nun. Fine. Pull over. What? I said pull over. I'm thirsty. Hi. Two scotches, doubles. I don't know what you're trying to prove. What's the matter, Logan? I never heard of a cop turning down a free drink. Should have told me these were the kind of spirits you're looking for. <sighs> Again. Maybe this time I could have it straight. Oh, we're straight, lady. Well, then, McGuire, you got a leak in your roof. Because this stuff's so watered down, it tastes like a goddamn Perrier. <laughs> I ain't McGuire. I'll do it. You drink like a vice cop. You know, that's seriously gonna fuck with your vibes. You should slow down on that stuff. I'm trying to get through to you, Logan. I'm trying real hard. But you've got this shell around you. It even started in a place like this, didn't it? Come on, Logan. Talk to me. It was two guys in ski masks, right? And your old man by himself closing up the bar. I don't need this shit from you. He died for no reason. And that's when you stopped believing in anything. You've got to believe in something. And it can't be vengeance, otherwise you're just like Channing. You've got to believe in this. You always talk this much? I mean, it's no wonder your boyfriend split. It wasn't my boyfriend. We just went out a few times. Amazing it lasted that long. I was an asshole. I shouldn't have said that about your boyfriend. It's all right. That's my problem. You know, I, I can tell everybody else what to do with their life, but my life is a total wreck. We have to go to Channing's house.
I know he's returned from the grave, but do you really think he's moved back in? Mrs. Channing, where We're from the post. We really hate to bother you, but these new pentagram killings could prove that Patrick wasn't guilty after all. I'd really like to talk to you if we could. All right. Is it too dark in here? Light hurts my eyes. Cataracts. No, it's fine. Oh, sit down. What made you decide Patrick was innocent now? Why didn't you see the truth sooner? Well, that's why we want to get the real story, Mrs. Channing. But that's my husband, Louis. He was a good man. The good always die young. Our daughter Sarah, she was Patrick's mother. She died when he was seven. What about Patrick's father? Patrick never knew his father. Oh, that's right. He was illegitimate, wasn't he? He was not illegitimate. He didn't mean anything. We loved him very much, especially Lewis. Mom just talking on. Where was Patrick's room? Why? We'd like to see another side of Patrick. I guess it would be all right. What could it hurt? He was a happy child. You tell them. Tell the world what a good boy he was. A murderer? That's just nonsense. He was always so quiet and considerate. Is he hurting her? Grandpa, don't touch her! I want you to leave now! You were there, weren't you? You saw it happen. You let it happen. I don't know what you're talking about. You let him molest his own daughter? Patrick never knew his father? I think he did. His grandfather, wasn't it? Wasn't it? I know who you are. 
You're not a reporter. You're that cop. You're a killer. A killer. You're the real murderer. Eternal punishment will be yours. Burn in hell. Burn in hell. Yes. Yes. What's down there? What do you see? Hey! Hey, you! What the hell you think you're doing? Homicide investigation. Get that thing out of my face. I don't care who the hell you are. You can't stay down here. It's unsafe. Why? What is this place? Part of the city's old water system. Got shut down after the major earthquake damage in 71. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things still work. It'll come flooding in. Kid got drowned down here a couple of years ago. That's why this thing's been blocked off. Channing used to come down here, didn't he? Hey, that was before me. Come on, you guys, we gotta leave. He's mad that we're here. This is his place. It's the only place he ever felt safe. He's laughing at us. He's going to kill again. I never thought you'd go this far, Marguerite. People came to me for help. I turned them away. I can't do that anymore. But that doesn't excuse the theft of a sacred church icon. Is it theft to use this for its real purpose? I believe Satan has granted one of his disciples the first power. Resurrection? Marguerite? Marguerite, I'll pray for you. We have to hurry. I don't know who, but he's going to kill someone else close to you. Would you see where? It's an area I recognize. It's off the Santa Monica Freeway. Attention all units, all units. Officer needs assistance. 2130 Julian near Alameda. Attention all units. Only a few blocks from here. Three Lincoln 43, I'm on it. Hold on.
stay here. Attention all units, officer needs assistance. 2130 Julian. You know which officer needs help, don't you, sweet gigs? It's Logan. Holding it upside down. You can't go on killing forever, Patrick. You want a bet? Trying to tell me that Grimes tried to kill you? What do you think, Al? I dragged him up there and dropped him on that spike for no reason? All right, yeah, yeah, he was a drunk and he was a total prick, but he was also a lieutenant in the LAPD. And I do not believe... And I do not believe that he suddenly went fucking insane or was uh, secretly a member of some fucking cult. Sir, Chief is here. Come yeah, on. yeah, yeah, I'll be there. You gotta give me some more time, Al. All right, but you get that fucking girl and you get out of here and you don't talk to anybody. You understand me? All right, go out the back way.
Nate's day off. What are we going to do? Buddy on the bomb squad gave me this stuff for a rainy day. A Channing can't do anything to us without using somebody else's body. So everyone he sends at us, we're going to send right back. That's great. What are we going to do, blow up the whole city? Well, what do you want me to say, Tess? Every time you kill the fucker, he bounces into somebody else. I'm sorry. What about Grimes? How'd he get into him? You said Grimes was an alcoholic. And people like that and junkies, they have less of a hold on reality, so they're vulnerable to him. Oh, terrific. That narrows it down to half of L.A. Logan, I don't know how to stop him. He, he just keeps getting stronger and stronger. Okay, what are we doing? I mean, this is crazy. Just my own refrigerator. Lady, she was outside the window. Tess, there's nothing out there. <laughs>
Open up. You want to hide out from the rest of the world in this little rat hole, I don't give a damn. But he's taking Tess, and I'm not leaving here until you tell me how to find her. You don't have any idea of what you'd be facing. I don't care. If it's not too late, he will have taken her to the dark place where he performed his rituals. I know where that is. Tess felt it. How do I stop him? It's not just stopping him. It's stopping a being who has the first power. There are three powers that can be bestowed by God or Satan. The third power is the ability to take over another person's body. Your friend is a psychic. She has the second power, the gift of knowing the future. The first power is resurrection, immortality. Look, sister, I don't understand these things. All I know is that I have to help her. There's just one way. Through the only soul in history who had all three powers. sister? Yes. Logan. Hurry. We have to get out of here. Sister Marguerite! 
Keep going. Sister, take my hand. Gee, thanks, Russ. So soon. I just got here. You come out and face me, you son of a bitch. Don't hide behind her. Don't you know that cursing is a sin? <laughs> you won't shoot a nun. Not a good little Catholic boy like you. Sister. Oh, I'm afraid she's not here. Keep fighting him, Marguerite. You can beat him. Don't give up. He isn't powerful. He's just a scared little boy who used to run and hide in the dark. You're pathetic, Logan. Tell me something, Patrick. It's just a wild guess. But I bet the first one you killed was your grandfather. Or should I say your father? Shut up. You didn't know I knew that, did you, Patrick? You had to watch him, didn't you? That was it. Shut up, Logan! You can beat him, Marguerite. Just you and me, buddy boy.
acid bath. See you around, buddy boy.